hey guys welcome back to a new vlog it feels so weird vlogging guys it's been a really long time ever since you guys seen us upload i believe it's been like a month and a half almost two months that we haven't uploaded anything for you guys these past few months have been hectic for us like you guys saw in our previous video we were moving we were going through a lot we we're going from airbnb to airbnb i even went to california for almost i want to say like a month i was out there by myself with romeo well with my family but without martin we literally went through a lot guys to get this house and now we're finally moved in we took a while to unpack all our things guys like like i told you guys in the last vlog i think i did tell you guys that we did get a storage for our stuff because of like the whole like house not being done and everything we had to get out of the apartment so yeah guys like we had to like take everything out of the storage and like clean it up and then come home and just unpack everything and i'm the type that i'm not comfortable unless all my shit is like where it needs to be you know so me like every fucking day i would go and go get a box and go unpack like I was literally doing the most to just finish unpacking and thank god we're already in december guys we moved in on october 20th so it's been like a month and a half since we've been living here but it took me like i want to say two weeks almost three weeks to unpack everything and we haven't bought anything like new for our room because i didn't want to do like a whole like room tour and everything with everything furnished and i wanted to get new things for my restroom which i did but i am going to be showing you guys that in another video it won't be this one but guys like i promised you guys i did do a little house tour it's not like a whole ass like walkthrough and everything it is a quick little walkthrough because it was the day that we moved in and we did want to like rush to storage and get our bed and everything so we did do what i did i did like a really fast tour you guys are going to see in the clip that i show you guys right now we did already have some stuff in the living room so literally guys like it was like three in the afternoon when we got here to vegas that day that we moved in because martin wanted to go pick me up from cali so we got here like around 3 p.m so the storage closed at six so we literally had three hours to just go get our like bed and like just stuff that we needed romeo stuff and everything so we did end up like just filming something really quick my brother does have a youtube channel but he didn't do a house tour for his channel but he did tell me to post this tour on my channel which i'm gonna be doing i'm gonna be showing you guys the house guys it's a beautiful house like it's a huge house and i'm in love with it like it feels like home i haven't told you guys how i felt but i am so happy like it took me a while to like get settled here we went through hell and back for this and it's all worth it but i am going to be showing you guys the clip right now we are finally home guys look how beautiful this house is so beautiful so guys we are entering the house right now this is how the kitchen looks guys it is so beautiful i love the color of the cabinets and then Storybook did get my brother a little goodie bag with like cleaning supplies and all that. But this is the dishwasher, the cabinet, the sink. Dude, I love the sink. It's so huge. And then we did get the, um, it came with appliances. It came with the stove and the microwave. But it didn't come with a fridge. But our fridge is getting here on Monday. Thank God. We did get a fridge and then don't mind the trash right there um there's more storage right here guys so that's what i love about this house there's so much storage like if you guys can see there's so many cabinets and then my favorite part of the kitchen is a pantry i am so excited to organize this pantry guys when you walk over here this is the living room guys don't mind the um the stuff guys we're already moving in so if you walk this way the staircase is right here the guest room and the guest restroom is right here. There's a shower, guys, a sink, and then a toilet. Don't mind me. I look like shit. But over here, this is the guest room, guys. Our guest room for our guests whenever they do decide to come over. We do have another closet in here. We were hoping it was a Harry Potter closet, but they put a wall here. But we're going to think about it. What if we knock that wall down? but yeah guys so that's the closet to the guest room now we are going upstairs i'm gonna be showing you guys upstairs real quick let me show you guys upstairs we have a window right here guys so it's so beautiful it gives you that nice sunlight sorry guys i'm breathing hard as fuck because 
we're literally unpacking right now but this is the hallway from upstairs here's a closet and then you turn left right here this is my cousin crystal's room she is gonna be our roommate here at this house her closet's right there. I don't want to touch her closet because she already has her personal things in there. Then when you get out of her room, automatically, it's these doors. And this is where the washer and dryer are going to be. They're going to be side by side. They're not going to be like on top of each other. So that's what's good, you know? And then when you turn around, there's another restroom, which is the second restroom to this house. There's a bathtub, a toilet, and then a sink. So that is nice. Then when you get out, this is my brother's room. So this is my brother's room. This is how it looks. He hasn't put anything in his closet, so I'm going to show you guys his closet. That's how big his closet is for Daniel and Reverie or Reverie and Daniel. He has a lot of space for his stuff. So that is my brother's room. So when you leave my brother's room, you're entering my room. Which is the master bedroom, guys. And it's so beautiful. Our walk-in closet is right here. It's super freaking big, too. I like how big it is. So, it fits for me, Martin, and Romeo. And then this is how our room is looking, guys. It's pretty big. It's really spacious. And then you walk over here, and we have a window. And then you come down this way, and we have a big old freaking mirror. And it looks like shit right now, so don't judge me. This is our freaking restroom. It's so huge. We have a bathtub, a toilet, double sinks. And then, like I was telling you guys, like, there's a lot of storage in here. Like, I love it so much. But, yeah, guys, this is my room. I love it so much. We're trying to put the TV right there, and then our bed is somewhere right here. But yeah, guys, I just wanted to show you guys a fast house tour real quick. But that is it, guys. And then the one thing I love about this house is that it's all white. And it's so fucking good for content creators like me. So I love that. And then that view of the sun. Beautiful. Okay, now that you guys saw the little tour I did for you guys. What do you guys think about the house? Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And as I told you guys, we did get here at 3 p.m. So don't mind me, guys. I look like shit in that video because I wasn't ready. I just wanted to come home and just finally just feel at peace, you know. And like I was saying, I know it's been a while since you guys have seen me on YouTube. But I've been going through some stuff mentally that, you know, a lot of people don't like to talk about. And that's something personal that i'm going through and let me know guys if you guys want to like chit chat with me about mental health and everything because it's real guys it's real depression is real everything's real postpartum hits hard guys and i know how it feels so don't ever feel like you are wrong for feeling a certain way or you're wrong for feeling depressed things happen guys it's life you know and yeah guys like once we moved in, I just felt like I was at peace. I finally just wanted to relax at home with no worries about, oh, let me pick up the camera, this and this. Like, I just wanted to enjoy myself and enjoy my baby. But I was telling Martin, like, like I feel like I just need Martin to, like, be there for me right now, you know? Like, just be there for me. Listen to me when I speak to him. You know, I'm going to get emotional right now. But, the guys, like, mental health is real, okay? Depression is real and you know anyone can get it anyone can get it and it's sad, but You got to be strong your mind needs to be stronger than anything, you know, but I didn't want to cry but yeah guys so I know we didn't vlog for Halloween and for Thanksgiving, but I did want to enjoy my moment with my family um, I've been going through a lot so I just wanted to just not pick up the camera and just enjoy the moment you know because the moments are like everything like when you have the camera you're like oh let me vlog this let me vlog that but in moments are everything to you you know memories and i just wanted to make memories for romeo and i just wanted just to focus on my baby you know for the holidays okay guys i had to get my shit together but like i was saying um I didn't vlog for the holidays, but this Christmas, I am going to be vlogging for you guys. I already told Martin, like, I need to just get out of this funk that I'm in and just do it, you know, because it's something that I love to do, and 
I just let some things get the best of me, which I shouldn't, you know, but like I was saying, I am going to be um, vlogging for Christmas and we are going to be doing a secret Santa with my family. So I am going to be vlogging that um, tomorrow. We are going Christmas shopping for our gifts and for um, our outfits for Christmas. So I, I'm going to be taking you guys with me. I didn't want to get emotional in this vlog at all. I didn't even think I was going to get emotional because I've been like just trying to get better for myself and for my family, you know, so it's just crazy because like people could think like you're the strongest person ever and they don't know what's going on in your head but you just gotta be strong you know and i know a lot of people out there they probably feel this way too a lot of moms you know you get that mom guilt and it just gets to you you know just mom guilts are just i don't know it's just something different when you become a mom your mindset just changes people don't talk about postpartum guys like moms don't talk about it they go through it but like they keep it all to themselves so that's the reason why I'm letting you guys know so you guys don't ever feel like you guys are crazy for feeling that way or anything because there's other moms out there that go through it. We just don't speak about it because it's not something you speak about. Like when you have a baby, you just post cute pictures of your baby and like you post all these happy things, but you don't speak about what's happening behind the camera, you know, but I am here to support are you mommies i know my content has been more about moms and i love it guys like i was posting on instagram and all i post is my baby like he's my whole life you know baby is getting so big he is about to be one in two months and i'm like how the hell does this happen like guys like i've been so like sad about it like really sad about it i've been crying about it a lot because my baby's gonna be one right now we are planning his birthday party we are gonna do it big for him i did posted something on my instagram that i was having his birthday in vegas guys but i actually came to a conclusion that i shouldn't have it in vegas that i should have it in california because everyone that loves my romeo lives in california and i don't want his first birthday for no one to show up for him i want him to have a memorable first birthday you know and i don't want him to look back at pictures and see like just a couple people there like i really want to do it big for my baby it's his first guys his big one and he only turns one once so i told martin like we did it big for him on his gender reveal we did it big for him on his welcoming party like we gotta do it big for his big one because he deserves it he's such a good baby guys he is like an angel sent from god literally because he is such a good baby like i don't know how i got so lucky with him but i did and i thank god for that i hope you guys enjoyed this video of a little house tour i did like tell you guys how i've been feeling and you know there's people out there that probably feel the same but don't speak about it but i'm here for you guys if you guys ever need to speak to anyone in the comments like i could talk to you guys through comments and instagram send me a dm and i'm here for you guys trust me you guys are not alone you guys are not alone at all it's normal if you're new to our channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the like button in this video guys i see a lot of people look at our videos but you guys don't subscribe so hit that subscribe button like right now pause this video and go subscribe once we hit 500 subscribers we are going to be doing a giveaway we don't know what the giveaway is going to be about but once we do know what's about we'll let you guys know but for now hit that subscribe button and tell your family and friends about us i'm not promising you guys anything but i'm going to try to like have more content up for you guys um our next vlog will be us um christmas shopping so I'll see you guys in our next vlog. By that being said, that is it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye guys. Mm -hmm.